Hi, my name's Mad Jack. I'm from Science Boffins. I'm going to give you a few tips how to make some really cool and interesting things with things you might find in your home. Right, now I'm going to show you how to make slime. Now today I'm actually going to be making fluorescent slime, uh, but at home you could use any coloration you wanted. Food colouring will do. Uh, as I say, here I have a special dye, it's called fluorescein. Uh, it's used in the medical business, it glows under UV light, um, allowing um, doctors and stuff to tell uh, where there's bacterial infection. Uh, then we have some PVA, now um, this is actually made from PVA crystals, similar to PVA glue, uh, but what you can see here, it's a lot thinner and is of course uh, basically colourless. Uh, then we have a stirrer, which we're going to need, and we also have a cup, uh, a lid, sorry, to put on afterwards. And we're going to be using borax as our binding agent. Um, and I've actually already mixed that up with some water, and that's going to help us make our slime. So, first of all, we need to take a very, very tiny piece of this dye. It goes a long, long way. That literally is enough. As you will see, this orange dye, in fact, will make a beautiful fluorescent yellow in this case. Okay, so we've mixed that up nicely. Now we need to get our borax solution. Uh, we're going to just pour some in. Doesn't need a lot. The more you put in, the thicker your slime will be. Uh, as you can see here already, we're starting to make our slime. The polymers in the PVA solution are being bound together by the borax. Borax is used as a binding agent, historically used as soap, in fact, because it would stick to the grease on your hands, and when you washed it off, clean hands and all of that dirt and luck would have stuck to your borax, okay. So it doesn't take very long, you need to give it a good mix, don't be shy about it. Now you'll know when it's ready because the liquid that you can see at the moment that's left from this liquid here, you can see that that liquid uh, will slowly be absorbed into our lump of slime and you won't have any liquid at all. I'll just add a tiny little bit more of our borax there. And do it. Now you can see the consistency suddenly has changed there. And we're getting all of that liquid absorbed in. Ten more seconds of stirring. And here we are lovely fluorescent slime is what we've got. I can pull it to quite a long chain here. I'm very, very careful, very gentle. So there we are, how to make slime.